fear, a tool to control, manipulate, and keep you broke. Fear, it's just a normal human emotion, but it is quite abrasive and penetrates much too deeply for far too many individuals. It can have a significant negative impact on your capacity to attain personal or professional goals, to feel satisfaction in your life, or to have a meaningful career. How you choose to deal with it, or if you choose to deal with it at all, will determine your ability to achieve and maintain success. Do you remember a moment when you had to turn down an opportunity because you were too hesitant to take the necessary actions? If so, do you regret missing out on that chance? That is the result of fear eating away at your dreams. Don't let that happen again. Why does the world play the be afraid game? Have you been keeping up with the latest news? What exactly is the focus of their headlines? Millionaires, TV news, and bloggers earn big money creating scarcity news, videos, and blogs. Be smart, don't bite on that. Be aware. It is all about fear and bad news, including economic recession, price hikes, reduced salaries, expected real estate market crash, expected stock crash, and a greater unemployment rate. Some people take advantage of it for their personal gain, while others go down with it, which is typical of most people in the middle class. System rulers and extremely rich people are earning on a mindset of scarcity. Usually, the middle class are putting their money into liabilities, such as houses, furniture, clothes, travels and automobiles, rather than purchasing assets with it. When bad news and scary expectations are put out on social media, middle class rush to put lower price tags on their valuable belongings and sell it. Because of this, they are unable to get out of the rat race that they are in. However, those who already have a lot of money are able to make more money out of this crisis by buying everything very cheap from the middle class and people with a scarcity mindset, like real estate, gold, stocks, art and jewelry. In short, they ride in the wings of low prices so they can soar with it in the future. Also, watching constant negative news, people are scared to make ends meet. During that time, they don't think about self-education or new knowledge. They stay in a rat race. If you don't give education to people, it is easy to manipulate quote of Pele. Do you want to be manipulated or educated and financially free? Fear will not let you go for opportunities. The middle class will hold on to paychecks. But remember, jobs don't create financially free people. Seek for passive income streams. Seek for entrepreneurship. Should you fear an economic crisis? Definitely not. Do you know that the majority of the millionaires in the world were made while the economy was in a horrible state? What's common among all of them? They use the economic crisis to generate more money in their pockets. As Warren Buffett said, In short, the bad news is an investor's best friend. It lets you buy a slice of America's future at a marked down price. Why should you stop listening to all the scarcity news? They are all just fear-based news, which programs your mindset to attract negativities and stay broke. It keeps you stagnant and it aggravates your anxieties. Rather, look for opportunities behind that downside facade. You should start believing and creating your reality. Don't be controlled and manipulated sheep. Be brave smart and take responsibility for your own life make small investments with a perspective on the long term diversify your income streams and devote some of your time to furthering your education and professional development you won't become a slave of the recession by engaging in these activities 
as the vast majority of uninformed people already are. Check the description section for great tools to use to create meaningful wealth and stand strong during any time. Thank you for watching and liking this video. We believe each family deserves financial independence and there are opportunities we can use to create that. Subscribe to the channel and see you next time.